And and then the third thing is, there's different. This day and time, the young people have such a vast opportunity to internet, to knowledge, to the Facebook world, to the internet world, to it's Google Plus things. now. Google Plus is, yeah, is really Google kicking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there's a website called LearnToFly.com. Okay. LearnToFly.com. Okay. That website gives you some basic ideas of what's required to be able to learn how to fly. Like you have to be able to read, speak the English language, know to have math, some basic math skills, adding, subtracting, dividing. That's it. Um, other than that, have an attitude and a positive attitude to learn. Once you do that, to be get your first license, you can get your first license at the age of 16. So let me ask you this, uh, because we're still, we're still, we're still being creative here. We okay. okay. Uh, how important is that attitude in getting over the hurdle of, of getting considered for this? It's very important because with the right attitude, you'll gain altitude because it changes your perspective on what you need to accomplish, what you need to do. And you don't have a problem with people telling you or suggesting to you what's needed. But if you don't want nobody to talk to you, you don't want to be bothered, this is not the place. It's yeah. a professional level. Yeah. So you have to have a professional mindset. And that mindset can be developed over time. But as a, like you said, what creative ways can it do? Even if you think you want to fly, there's a place at Gary Airport every second Saturday of the month. There's a program called Young Eagles. They'll take you up to fly for free to see if you like it. It's every second Saturday at the Gary Airport. And the program is called Young Eagles. They'll start at 10 o'clock till 2 o'clock. You go out there, no cost to you but to get there. Tell your parents. They'll take you in the airplane, let you fly it. And you may get hooked, you may not. But aviation is a vast growing with technology. Asia is buying up airplanes left and right. They need pilots. They need pilots globally and worldwide.